Hi, so you join me in Cardiff today. Uh, I always like to include you on some of my travels, but, um, but yeah, there's loads of festivities going on today. We're down in the Cardiff Bay area. So Cardiff, if you didn't know, is the capital of Wales. And uh, behind me is the sort of Bay area, and we'll have a look at that in a minute. But for the time being, we're gonna have a little walk over to the Millennium Centre, which is this massive building just over there. So synonymous for the front of the building um, and the way it looks, it's just a little bit different, it's really, really cool. Um, so I'm down in Wales to, um, uh, to do a bit of photography, I'm doing some training courses and stuff for some people and um, yeah, it should be, should be really good. It's so hot though, it's lovely, really, really nice, nice big blue skies and everything else. So I need to choose something to eat for dinner actually, I'm not too sure what to go for. Um, but yeah, so let's go and have a, a quick look over here. Um, so like I say, behind me is the bay area and you've got um, loads of beautiful boats down there, loads of lovely places to eat. I really recommend coming down here if ever you come to the UK. Um, they do have a main street for uh, shopping and all the rest of it, which I'll try and show you tomorrow. Um, but for the time being, let's have a quick look at this beautiful uh, millennium uh, building that we have here. So you can see straight away, it's very difficult the way I've got it around this way, but you can see already the, the odd shape it comes out from the wall. So um, let's go have a look. Hey, what I'm struggling this heat. <laughs> so in the distance you can see like the main part of the city with the high-rise buildings um, but up here you can see as we get a little bit closer I'll try and uh, it's a beautiful beautiful building so if we stand back a little bit over here should be able to get a bit of a better view of it. It's quite far back. It's got loads of unusual sort of architecture and things like that. But, but it really is a lovely place to go. I mean, look at the red building over there. I'm not sure what actually that building is, but it looks lovely. There you go, that's a bit of a look at it. That's the famous Millennium Building in Wales. So let's go and um, let's go and walk down and a little bit uh, have a bit uh, bit of a better look at the uh, the actual bay now. Um, so I hope I'm not boring you too much, but I just thought I'd share what this place looks like because I'm always interested in, in different countries and the cities and the towns, what they're like, what's really like, you know. Sometimes off the tourist trail and everything. So, uh, so yeah, let's have a look. So it looks pretty cool in there. So yeah, um, Darcy's um, been looked after by my wife at home, so she's all good. Ebby got in one hell of a scrap, literally at my feet as well. I was just getting the boys into the, uh, into the car to take them to nursery. And there's a black cat that lives opposite us, and it's always hated Ebby. And Ebby's such a gentle little soul. She saw her and cowered and tried to get in the car, and the door was shut, unfortunately. And um, before I could even get to let her in the car, so the cat went for her, literally at my feet, and it's... It's bizarre, you'd think you'd just be able to reach down, grab them and separate them, but it was just crazy, they were all over the place. Um, and poor old Debbie lost a bit of fur and everything else, um, so I just made sure she was okay. She had, she, she had a lot of fur, um, a lot of fur, she had a bit of fur missing, um, but actually I couldn't even locate any major scratches, but it looked terrible, and the noise was horrendous. So, um, so anyway, yeah, they're okay, they're good. I hope you lot are all okay. I'm huffing and puffing as I'm trying to uh, make my way down here for you. But yeah, all the food places here uh, are absolutely lovely. Really good places to eat. I'm trying to choose one myself, actually. I'm starving. Um, so yes, basically what I'm doing down here now is once it quietens down again, it gets a bit darker. Um, I'm going to be taking a series of shots of some of the uh, sort of statues they've got around here. They've got some really cool stuff and playing with the lights and everything else. Um, so let's have a look over here. There you go, you can start to see it now. Should, uh, should open up out before you. There's loads of like tourist boats and things down here that you can go on. So this is the bay. You see the big ships out through the centre there. There you go. It's actually fresh water this. It's not actually joined to the sea. A lot of people think it is, but it's actually not. There you go. So 
Well, hopefully that helped anyway and give you a little idea about Cardiff Bay and what it's like. And uh, yeah, hope you have a really good day. Bye.